Cameroonians that Fundi is one that Cameroonians can count on. Okay. As from the beginning, where multipartism started in this country, he enumerated goodwill okay. and up to date, he will still be. Obetra, we are concluding the program. In 1966, President Madia Ayujo abolished <coughs> multi-party system and adopted one-party system. Mm -hmm. 1990, <coughs> the then SDF <coughs> chairman, Ney John Fundi, brought the rebirth of multipartism in Cameroon. That is to say that we cannot write Cameroon history without dotting down the name of the chairman, me, John Fundy. Cameroon politics has proven that we are not one, that in politics we are enemies, which is not always the case. We believe in several, we have seen several areas where the, the chairman has been humiliated just to have um, a political, uh, 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 political um, failures. But I want to say that the SDF, under the canopy of the new John Fundy, is one of the reasons why we are still benefiting or enjoying some degree of freedom in the country. Because I, I, if, if I tell you that they will, for, I, I think there's an elect, uh, SDF uh, person on this planet, the SDF has been under political competition with the CPDM for competitive about some... Uh, 20 some 25 25 years of uh, uh, effective 25 years or something of that nature 28 years uh -huh. so that is to tell you that for if, if we have left this country only for cpdm then by now what where and what where and where will we be so i i want to come back to go back to the case of the the, the, the visitation of limbe and the paramount chief handing the key to funding you see you see, some people, some, we, we have, uh, let me put it the way it is, and I, I take responsibility for it. We have let go of our values and tradition. You see, delicacy is something that, for a Bakure man, when you enter in somebody's house and they serve you kwakoko timonambusa, it means that you are a guest of honor. And when you enter into a bangi man and, and they serve you a, bar, a fufu and eru, it means that you are a guest of honor. And if this young paramount chief of Limbe may have read his political, the political life of Cameroon and realized that this is a figure in Cameroon that has played a major role. And he comes to the a region of this, which he is an Anglophone by orientation. This is his region, even though a political split, this will have still been under one, 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 one map. Yes. So if he felt that he should yeah. give... No, one man. Yes, one man. We, we should give this man this type of respect. And after we heard of the scandal that when it, it, it jeopardized our political, uh, our, our, our political stamina. Know, people are just saying that when he comes, he should it, be received it, it, as a state man. He should, be, he should be received as a state man. He should be received as a state man. He has played a role. Okay. I believe that we, we, we don't respect our own. We don't respect our own. I still cry because somebody like Mulan Jolly Tumbe died in this country and we, they, there was no impact. We, we did not feel any impact like somebody who, who, who took part in the geopolitics of this nation. Of this nation. But because his politics did not favor the, 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 the center power, he was forced to be humiliated. And that is why you see that there are other political parties across the Mongo who can cross, can, who have, whose political figures' heads have crossed. Uh, have crossed Happened to the other parties, and of course, we have satellite parties who benefit the largest of the ruling party. But we want to say that politics and democracy is a, comp is a competitive um, um, area and it's a competitive zone. Okay. We let us practice true politics Pope in Cameroon. Thank you so very much for coming for the program today. Oh, Mr. Morito, um, I thank you very much for this singular opportunity to make me feel that by biblical calculus. It is three scores in that a man lives a fulfilled life on earth. But President Amadou Aijo lived for 65 years and was laid to rest and passed on. We want to say that as man, we may not do it all. We may not accomplish our missions on earth. But whatever you do, do it well because you shall be remembered for it. Legacy will stand to judge you. Thank you, Mr. Moderator. And I want to also thank uh, my fellow panelists, Mola, who 
Mola Ifuko, who I'm sharing the panel with, is a political figure that when we grow up in the, uh, uh, on, on the street of support, we are wondering that uh, what, 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 what formation, what, what political confinement do they enjoy in the political world until these days when we can also share panels like this with them, um, we feel the way Samuel Etofis felt <laughs> when he was playing with Ronald Mr. Fuqua John, the SDA Vice Chair for Boya and the Regional uh, Organizing Secretary for the Southwest SDA. Thank you so very much for coming for this program. Thank you, Mr. Moderator. Uh, thank you, CMTV, for inviting me. Uh, the pleasure is mine to be with you. And um, hopefully, I think I will be with you in the next program. And um, as I leave this panel, I uh, will say that um, I still advocate for Cameroon and one and indivisible. Mm -hmm. And uh, we say that um, as an SDF militant, I still advocate for good governance and um, um, the rights for children to go to school. That our brothers should be able to think, those that are holding arms, I don't know them. And they might, they, I, I think they know me or neither they don't know me. But I'm saying that our children are our future of tomorrow. They are the future leaders of this country. So whatever we are doing, we should be thinking about them. And that is why we are for this struggle that Cameroon should be a place to be, not a place to hear. Thank you very much. Dear viewers, this is where we come to the end of Crosby on CMTV today, given that we really want to thank uh, these two gentlemen, especially uh, Mr. Efokwa John, the organizing secretary of the SDF for the Southwest region and the assistant chair for Boya, who we removed him from his sick bed after giving him this invitation, but he had a malaise, but he said no. Even at the last minute, we said he could not fail. He just left from his drip and came here. We want to thank him so very much. We want to promise you that uh, next edition, we shall still come back to this where we shall discuss the Cameroon of 1961 of Aijo right to the Cameroon of uh, 1982 of President Paul Bia, because we know very well Aijo resigned on the 4th, that is today, 4th of November 1982. Then President Paul Bia took over from the 6th of November 1982. Then from that 82, we shall look at the New Deal right up to today, 2020. That's what we are, shall be looking at. Then we shall be looking at SDF at 30. It's unfortunate we had to postpone that topic, given that uh, Mr. Efokwa is here. He's going to give us some information, some hidden information that Cameroon and Cameroonians never knew. But we shall know it on Friday. See you next time. Thank you so very much. I've been Modrito Mwambu-William. <laughs>